Hello, I'm Ingrid Barker and I'm Chair of Gloucestershire Health and Care NHS Trust, which is the organisation behind this amazing event organised by Simon Shorrick for the last 14 years. And here we are today with so many stalls and activities and loads of different things going on for people to join in with. And it's such an important day because here we are with hundreds and hundreds of people with learning disabilities from across the county being offered new activities, new ways of staying healthy and well and just having fun. The Big Health Check Day is just an unbelievable event. It's an opportunity to reconnect with people you haven't seen in a very long time, particularly post-pandemic. It's been amazing to see people face to face. And even more so, it's an opportunity to see people who you want to support. There's been so much engagement, so many people coming up to us and asking what we're doing and how we're linking in with other partner agencies to tackle these issues. It's just amazing to come along and just to see all of the people that are collaborating together, working together to see what's out and about there. I really enjoy helping at the Camden Day. Today I'm going to be doing drama and dance, which has been very good and everyone so far has been enjoying it. It's nice to look around the stalls, see what's been offered, see what's happening in Gloucestershire. It's nice that we finally got in here and doing what we do best, which is showing what Gloucestershire has to offer. We're here today to show our trikes, let people try them out. So we've got multi-user trikes, we've got trikes with somebody with a bit more um, mobility needs, um, and we've got standard trikes as well. It's been so wonderful meeting lots of different people. There's people who might want to come along and get involved in the work we do, but also other organisations who we might already work in partnership with to achieve amazing things for people who face the same barriers. I've really enjoyed myself today. It's been lovely to see lots of many people. I've been here and I've mixed with many people. It's good for GTA to learn about other services and what's best, how to refer people to other places. It should all really benefit our deaf community, but it's also good that everyone sees us and knows how to refer to us as well. The event is super important for us at Hartbury. Altogether, we have 85 volunteers at the event. It helps with extra qualifications and it's a great opportunity for our students to mingle and mix and gain that vital experience. It'd be nice meeting people and talking to people and finding out different things that help people with disabilities, mental health, learning disabilities, etc. And your health checks are for anyone in Gloucestershire who's over the age of 14 and has a learning disability and it's really important that everyone gets an annual health check every year. There's some information here that you can register with your GP that you've got a disability. We are running training in retail and catering, vocational training for adults with learning disabilities and autism. What we're trying to do is to combine the resource that we have with giving people a life of opportunity through vocational training. We support people to lose weight, get active, reduce drinking and stop smoking. And we're so grateful to be a part of today because we've been able to connect with so many organisations and also get some clients on board for some of our journeys to work with our health coaches. It's vitally important that diabetes is treated and on a day like this we want to get that message across. We've really enjoyed our day. We've helped a number of parents that have felt that they've struggled to access getting their children vaccinated. It's just been a joy to be here. The people that have been around have been really friendly. Yeah, and some cake and strawberries. We did have cake and strawberries. <laughs> so proper bonus. We really thank everyone for coming today. It's been an absolute magic day. The day itself is to create awareness of activities and organisations within our county especially those that have been open during COVID or after COVID, to meet people face to face. And that's been a major breakthrough forward. The activities we've got on the inclusive sports has made a big impact on people. Thank you all again.